Hi, I'm Alois Rosario from Ping Skills. Sartvik is a modern defender and he's asked us about how to deal with the drop shot. Sartvik is finding that whenever his opponent plays a drop shot, he ends up giving them a high ball that they can attack easily. Sartvik, the key is to be able to move in quickly so that you're getting to that ball early enough to play it effectively. So you've made your chop, you see that ball is coming short with a drop shot. It's important to make sure you firstly run in and then get really close to that drop shot so that you can then play it effectively and play it low. Once you get there, you need to make that stroke effective. How are you going to make it effective? One way is to be able to drop the ball short. That's going to make it difficult for your opponent to attack. The other way is to push that ball long and fast and deep, again, making it difficult for them to attack. The other thing to think about is the depth of your chop to start off with. If you can keep that chop deep on the table, it's gonna be more difficult for the attacker to drop that ball short. But if your chops are landing short on their side, then it's gonna be much easier for them to play a really effective drop shot. So that short chop was easy for Jeff to drop it short on my side. If your opponent plays a drop shot, the key is to be able to move in as quickly as possible and then play an effective shot by either dropping it short or pushing it long and deep. But thinking back a step, you can avoid a, an effective drop shot by keeping your chops deep on the table.